Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. It's Girl Fanny Lungu back with another reaction video. If you're new to this channel, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and of course, do not forget to subscribe. Like I said, my name is Fanny Lungu, and on this channel, we post reaction videos each and every day. So if there's something that you guys want us to react to, let us know by dropping a link in the comment section below, and we'll do it for you. You can check out our second YouTube channel called Funny and Jesse 2.0. You can hit the subscribe and enjoy our weekly content. We've got a podcast called Diving In with Funny and Jesse, and we have some amazing conversations which you guys don't want to miss. You can find us on iTunes, Spotify, Podbean, this channel, or our second YouTube channel for the visual. And we've got a Patreon which you guys can feel free to become members and will appreciate. A big shout out to everyone that has subscribed to our channel so far. Thank you for subscribing, liking, commenting. And just everything else that you guys are doing, we are very, very grateful. And I hope you guys are doing right and may you stay blessed. Today I'm going to be reacting to what one of you suggested. I'm going to be reacting to Allah loves to forgive, come back to him. So without wasting time, let's get into the video. Ah, ah, I love you You meet people who look at you and they insult religion, they insult you. This is not because they don't like you. This is not because they mean what they're saying. It's because in their heart, they have gone to hardness and they have misled themselves and they don't even realize. Because Allah says in the Quran, if you forget me, I will cause you to forget yourself. You won't even realize why you're like that. And his solution is one. All he has to do, good news again, all he has to do, Allah says in the Quran, فَفِرُّ إِلَى اللَّهِ and the tafsir from Ibn Qayyim al-Jawzir, he says that when Allah says, Fafiru illallah, it's from a distance. He's saying to you, run back. How can, it can't get more romantic and beautiful than that. I don't want you to go. Come back. And the moment you make tawbah and you're saying, Allah, forgive me. Do you feel it, the burning? Do you feel the eyes welling up sometimes? You feel the heart when you're at home, you're going to pray. You can feel the emotions coming. This isn't you. You can't decide, I want to repent. You cannot decide, I want to be forgiven. This is him. And he puts khushu in your heart and he pulls you. You just took instant and he guided the rest. You just instigated the slightest bit of your heart towards him. And he says, think of me, I'll think of you. Come to me, I'll come to you. Walk to me, I'll come to you at speed. Who else can remove the sins and forgive you except Allah? A believer is certain that I just repented and Allah has forgiven me. That is a fard, ayn. It is a must. It's obligatory that you believe that I made repentance and Allah has forgiven me. I'm an engineer. I'm an IT engineer. He's a doctor. He's this. She's that. Allah says, I am. I accept. I forgive sins and I accept repentance. He will definitely forgive you and he will definitely accept your repentance. Fafiru illallah. Run back to me. You've walked far away. When you commit sins, you go away from your Lord. Run back to that beginning, the fitra. Polish your heart. Remove the black spots and come back. And I will forgive you. Inna Allah. Inna Allah. He says, I am in love with those who repent. So long as my slave continues to come back to me, so long as he realizes I am a forgiving Lord, oh, my angels bear witness, I will forgive him no matter what he does. I think I said this in my one of my previous videos that sometimes a relationship is a two-way thing not sometimes a relationship is a two-way thing I'm talking about the relationship with God and yeah you just can't expect to always get blessings without you put in work you can't always expect good things to happen to you when you don't do any good in life it's a two-way street you put in something the other person also put in something you do something, you'll be rewarded with something. That's how life works. And that's how it should be. For as long as you know God, you're always going to have someone, a friend to talk to. You will never feel alone. But sometimes when you think you're the only person in the world, has have no friends, or you're just feeling lonely, don't let that loneliness uh, consume you. Because then you'll be led to think bad things. You'll be made to feel pity for yourself, which you're not supposed to do. But anyway... 
let me know what you guys think about this short video what are your thoughts on allah allows to forgive what are your thoughts on that and your comments are always welcome make sure to give this video a thumbs up share it with your friends and of course do not forget to subscribe and i'll see you in my next reaction video